Hey guys, good news, I have a fitness app. You get to work out live with me and other amazing trainers every single day. Go on, download Feel on the App Store or go to feellife.com and start your journey to become. Do you experience tight and sore muscles after your workout session? Do you complain that I am just not flexible? The good news is you can increase your flexibility by stretching regularly. So let's go through a really simple yet effective 10 minute stretch sequence which you can do first thing in the morning and this will also boost your energy levels. So let's go through each stretch for about one minute long, okay? So we want to stretch the entire body. Start by standing right at the corner of your mat. And this stretch, you will not require a lot of space at all. So you can do this in your bedroom, okay? So the first stretch is going to be inchworm. I want you to stand at the corner, just reach up, stretch up, look up and reach down. Slowly inch forward, okay? Get into a plank position, feel your body and inch back so slow inch good stretch your hamstring reach up again give thanks to the beautiful day back down and slowly inch forward keeping your legs straight okay do not bend your knees feel your hamstring stretch press down into the floor and back good and now breathe in and go back down, keeping your legs straight and slowly inch forward. Very good. Into a nice plank, feel your shoulders press into the floor and go back. Very good. And now just breathe in and relax. Good. The second stretch will be plank to downward dog, okay? So I want you to start in a plank position and just Point your butt up into the air into a nice downward dog. Feel your calves and back down into a plank and back up. So these are all dynamic stretches to really stretch your entire body out. And also at the same time, you're lengthening your muscles. So good, downward dog, press your heels into the floor and release into a nice plank, good. And every time you do that, you will feel that your calves muscles will loosen up. Good. As you press into the floor, feel your back being stretched out as well, okay? Press in, look in between your legs, release into a plank. Very good. If you want to, you can walk it out a little bit to feel that stretch even more. Good. Just walk it out and just come back up. Very good. The next will be lunge with a twist, okay? So stand right at the edge of the mat, Step forward, lunge, and I want you to just step and twist to the side. Good. Now bring it back, change leg, step, hands down and twist. Good. So open up and look up. Back, opposite side and twist. So you will start to also warm up your legs. Good. Step, down and twist. Very good. Again, lunge back, step forward and twist. Good. There you go. So use the power from your legs to step forward and step back and open up your chest, twist, look the opposite side. Step forward and twist, open up, look up, good. Do more and open up, very good. Now just relax for a little while. Let's stretch your groins and also your inner thighs, okay? So start back, get into a nice plank position, all right? One leg, right leg to your right hand and just push it, open it up and release, change left side. Again, dynamic stretches, okay? So we're not holding the stretch, we're flowing constantly. Take it back, right leg, push, open up, feel your groins, feel your butt cheek, feel your inner thighs, bring it back into a plank and push it, open it up. Keep going, step forward. Back, push it, open it up. Down, bring it back. One more on the right side, open it up. Feel the stretch, good. And now bring it back, good. And now get back up 
and let's do saddle stretch, okay? So this will really target your inner thighs and your glutes as well. So stand wide, face forward, and I want you to just go side to side. So side and side, good. Just bounce slightly and just keep it gentle, keep it flowing. You should feel your inner thighs being stretched out. Keep your chest up, open up your chest and push your butt back, good. Keep going, keep your heels on the floor, very good. Every time you move, I want you to go deeper, go lower and stretch even more. That's how you increase your flexibility, by going deeper every stretch, good. Keep going, keep flowing, push your butt back, open up your chest and look straight ahead. Very good. Breathe, remember to breathe with every stretch. Keep going, last one, and stand up. Good, now let's get into a reverse plank, okay? So, start on your butt, place your hands on the mat, okay? I want you to get up into a reverse plank, this way, and just bring your butt down and push it up. So just stay on your heels, bring it down, gentle, push it back up, squeeze your butt and bring it down. Imagine there's a string pulling your belly button right up, down, up, look up and down. Nice and controlled, up and down, very good. So this is a reverse plank and you will really feel it on your butt cheeks and also your hamstrings. Good. Every time you repeat, push and go higher. Nice. And your upper body should just be relaxed. Down, up, one more, and down. Right, cat and cow stretch. This stretch, everybody knows this and it is really good for your lower back, okay? So get into all fours. Right, ready? So arch, look down, curl your body, and now reverse. Good, look up, feel your lower back being stretched out, and now curl it. Good, relax your shoulders, feel your shoulders, and arch. So your feet should be flat on the floor. Good, curl, breathe in, and breathe out. Again, breathe in, and breathe out. Nice. Relax your shoulders. Press into the floor. Arch. Look up. Reverse. Last one more. Arch. Very good. And now I just want you to drop your body onto the floor and give me a nice cobra stretch. Okay, so arms by your side, close to your chest, and gently roll your shoulders and push yourself back up and feel your back being stretched out. Very good. And again, lower it down and press it back up. Good. So do not hunch, okay? Remember to push and bring your shoulders down. And let's get back down. Every time you repeat, go deeper, go further. Challenge yourself even more. If you have tight lower back, this is a really good stretch for you. Down again, look down, push up, and feel it even more on your lower back. Squeeze your butt cheeks, feel it even more. Good. Down again, one more, push it up. Very good, and now just bring your butt back and fall into a nice, Charles pose, your favorite pose. Everybody loves this, okay? So just relax into the pose. Remember, this is a relaxing position. Don't try too hard to make it complicated, okay? Just relax, sink your butt in and just stretch it out. Feel your back stretched out. If you want to, you can inch forward slightly to feel a deeper stretch, good. Just relax into the pose. Center your mind, focus on your breathing. Breathe in and breathe out. You can also bring your hands back, okay? And just let your body collapse and allow your, the gravity to stretch your entire body out. Good. Very good. And now, 
slowly come back up, stand back up. I want you to take a few deep breaths, all right? So this is my favorite. I want, you, I want you to release all your bad energy, okay? And start your day right. So breathe in. As you come down, sigh. <sighs> Good. Again, bounce it. Breathe in. Stretch out, stretch up. Ready? <sighs> Give me two more. Breathe in. Reach up. Stretch, tiptoe. <sighs> One last one, okay? One last one, guys, for good luck to start your day right. Breathe in. Take in all the breaths you can take in. Stretch up. And... <sighs> Very well done, okay? So these are really simple and gentle stretches which you can do first thing in the morning. It will help you to increase your flexibility over time and most importantly, you will have more energy to start your day, okay? You should feel more awake and trust me, you will have an amazing day ahead. All the best, don't forget to stretch daily.